For each of the following compound statements, first we need to identify the connecting words and we need to break them into component statements. Let us see the solution for these statements now. So the given statement is all rational numbers are real and all real numbers are not complex. While reading the statement itself, you can understand very well that what is the connecting word. So the connecting word is and. So let us write here the connecting word is and and the two statements are the first one is before the connecting word and the next one is after the connecting word. The first one is all rational numbers are real and the second one is all real numbers or not complex. Now let's move on to the second part now. The statement reads square of an integer is positive or negative. So here or is the connecting word. So the connecting word is R and the first of the two component statements here is square of an integer is positive and the second statement is square of an integer is negative. In this problem, we have to identify the connecting words and also break into the component statements for the given statements. Let us see the solution for this. The given statement is the sand heats up quickly in the sun and does not cool down fast at night. Now in this, the connecting word is and and the two component statements are the sand heats up quickly in the sun and the next second statement is the sand does not cool down fast at night. Now that fourth statement is x is equal to 2 and x is equal to 3 are the roots of the equation 3x square minus x minus 10 is equal to 0. And here the connecting word is and. And the component statements are the first one is x is equal to 2 is the root of 3x square minus x minus 10 is equal to 0 and the next statement is x is equal to 3 is the root of 3x square minus x minus 10 is equal to 0.
In this problem, we have to identify the quantifier and also we need to write the negation of the given statements. Let us see the solution for this now. The given statement is, there exists a number which is equal to its square. So here is the quantifier. So the quantifier is there exists and now it is also asked to write the negation. Let us write the negation of the given statement now. So the negation is there exists no number which is equal to its square. Now the second statement is, for every real number x, x is less than x plus 1. And in this statement, the quantifier is for every. And let us write the negation of this statement now. For every real number x, x is not less than x plus 1. By writing the not, we are writing the negation. Let's see the third one now. The given statement is, there exists a capital for every state in India. So the quantifier is there exists. So the negation for this statement is there exists a state in India which does not have a capital. In the given question, we need to check whether the two given statements are negation to each other or not. Let us see that now. Let us look at the first statement which reads x plus y is equal to y plus x is true for every real number x and y. Let us write the negation for this statement and let us check with the other statement whether the second statement is the negation of the first or not. There exists a real number x and y for which x plus y is not equal to y plus x. If we look at the second statement, this second statement says there exists a real numbers x and y for which x plus y is equal to y plus x. So both statements are true in their own respect. So this second, the negation of the first statement is not equal to the second statement given here. So the negation of Statement 1 is not equal to statement 2. That implies the given two statements are not negation of each other. In the following statements, the word R is used. 
we have to say whether this R is an exclusive or an inclusive. Let us see them now. Now the statement is sunrises are moon sets. Now in this statement R is exclusive as both incidents here that is sun rises and moon sets cannot be true simultaneously. Let us see the second one now. The second statement says, to apply for a driving license, you should have a ration card or a passport. Here, R is inclusive because For applying a driving license, a person can have both ration card or a passport. Ration card and a passport. The third statement reads, all integers are positive or negative. Here, R is exclusive as an integer cannot be positive. as well as negative. 